What's up YouTube Sweatpants Joe here. Today I've got Hoffman, German brand Franks. Haven't had Hoffman before. These are the popular hot dogs in Syracuse, New York. They're based out of Syracuse. And uh, I'm gonna try them. I brought them on the airplane from New York all the way to California. And I'm gonna try the Hoffman brand. I'm gonna take these downstairs, I'm gonna grill them up, and I'll see you down there. And here's what the hot dogs look like before we grill them. I'm supposed to let them sit out for a half hour. And that's what I did. Okay, so according to their website, we want you to cook them on an angle at medium heat, seven to 10 minutes. And uh, that's what I'm doing. I just put them on the grill. And in about three and a half, four minutes, I'm gonna flip them and then they should be done. Okay, and here's how I dressed the hot dogs. One with just the hot dog sauce that I showed in the last video, if you didn't watch that last video. It's uh, this hot dog sauce from Up the Creek, West Virginia. Check out their website, upthecreekmustard.com. I highly recommend this. And the other one with just mustard and relish. Now, I only dressed it on half the hot dog because I also wanted to taste it without any dressing to get an accurate taste of this hot dog. Okay, here we go. This is gonna be the plain side. Hoffman's hot dogs, first time trying it. And as you can see, it shattered out of, the, out of its casing. I tried to read the instructions and do it that way, but my buddy says it happens to him all the time. That's different. That is very different. It's very smoky. You're definitely getting a different tasting hot dog. Different than anything I've ever tasted before in my life, as far as hot dogs go. It's a good thing, trust me. It's a good thing. This is not what I was expecting, but I am pleasantly surprised. This is, this is really good. I don't know why I was bending over in the kitchen. I have kitchen chairs. Let's give it another bite. This is, this is, this is really special. This is a good hot dog. Let's try it with the mustard and relish. I didn't know what I was expecting going into this, but I'm pleasantly surprised. It's got a very smoky flavor. It's got almost a sausage taste going on, but it's definitely a hot dog. And um, I just, I love this. This is, you cannot get good hot dogs in California. I don't know why. We're stuck with the Hebrew Nationals and the Hoffies and the Farmer Johns, they're nowhere near as good as these. This is, and this Hoffman's, holy cow. This is something else. This is something else. I'm gonna rate it now. On a scale of PU, it stinks the sunshine, lollipops, and rainbows. I'm giving the Hoffman's hot dogs. This is tough because I grew up on Salins and I love Salins. And I gave this Weigel's and I like it a lot. I'm going to give the Hoffman's and I like it a lot as well because for different reasons, for different reasons altogether. These are just, just very good. They taste different than any hot dog I've ever had. And I just, I wanna eat more. 
I want to eat more of them. They're so good. And like, if for me, like, I would say you would have one A, one B, one C between Salins, Hoffmans, and Zweigels. You can't go wrong with any of them. You can't go wrong with any of them. They're so good in different ways. Um, Salins is the smoky. I didn't review Salins on the channel, but you can go watch my Ted's Hot Dog review. And that was of a Salins. Salins is smoky and salty, and I love it. The Zweigels is sweet, and I love it. These, holy cow. This is a whole different, this brings a whole new genre to hot dogs. This is, these are really good. Go to the grocery store, get yourself some Hoffman's. You know, if you're a Salins person or a Zweigels person, just get some Hoffman's this weekend. Grill them up. You won't be disappointed. You'll be glad you changed it up and you might like something new. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Wardinsky's is next, by the way. We're going to do a Wardinsky's review. I got some of those as well. Thank you.